the best part of Sundance are the documentaries. You know, you can people are fighting for the tickets for the hot films, but the um, the documentaries in Sundance are so great. You know, time and time again, that you know they're, they're my favorite films I see, and uh, and to be part of that, to have one film amongst all those other great films is so special. I'm Davis Guggenheim. I'm the director of Waiting for Superman, and I'm in the documentary competition at Sundance. Waiting for Superman is about the public school system in America, but it's um, a story we we're familiar with, but it's told completely different. It deals with um, this sort of feeling, I think, that we all share, that, 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 uh, that there are schools that are in trouble, but we don't know what to do about it. Cut against these five families that are trying to find great schools for their kids. We, we wanted a, a film that sort of represented the whole country. So we're in uh, East LA, and then we're um, um, in Harlem, and we're in uh, Northern California, but there's a there's a great commonality in all of it. You know, every parent wants so much for their kid. Every parent wants, you know, their full potential to come out. And you see, there, you see families that have it. You know, and they have a school that's 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 helping exploit that great potential. And you see, brilliant kids that spark, going into schools that are just not serving that. Um, and I, that's the thing that drives me. It's like, wh why can't there be a great school for every kid in America? It just doesn't make sense to me why there isn't. And uh, it's, that's why I made this movie. One of the really exciting things about going to Sundance this year is we're bringing Jeffrey Canada, who is this great educator in Harlem, who, if you're in the education world, you know about him. He's transformed the way people think about public schools. I think when people see him, they'll say, this, this guy's a rock star, you know, just from this little documentary, but you see this guy is, is going to change the face of public education in America. This is the first film where I've actually, um, that I actually narrate and I put myself into, and I, so I talk about how um, I betray my own ideals every morning as I drive my kids past three public schools on the way to take my kids to a private school. And it, and it, Every day I think about it. On one hand, my ideals are that, that the public schools are important and a great thing and we have to be part of them. On the other hand, my kids need a great education. I'm trying to make, turn that feeling into a reason to make the movie, but also a reason for other people to connect to, to this dysfunction. Like, I'm part, you know, it starts with my own dysfunction. It starts with my own sort of betrayal of my own ideas, and I think it speaks to the larger betrayal that we all do, that as a country we've sort of betrayed these ideals of sort of letting um, mediocrity and dysfunction sort of prevail uh, in this very important thing that is public schools in America. Mm -hmm.